Hi there, and in this video I'm going to show you an SSR project for Unity 5 made by user Code80. So this is not my project, uh, just to mention that this is not my project. So what it does, so I click this play button. Of course, the link to this project will be available in description below, so don't worry. So, you click play button and you can use your mouse to control the camera. So, you just hold left uh, mouse button and you just control your view. And you can see that also I can use my WASD buttons on my keyboard to control my movement. You can see that we have here uh, screen space reflections, just like in a GTA, GTA 5. So it's very really cheap method, but it's very really nice for uh, middle range PC, just like mine. And it's very really cool effect, so you can reflect exactly what uh, should be re reflected in your, uh, you know, view. So you, you can see that I have here a plain uh, box here is a block, and these are rotating uh, one bit. Means a, a figure is showing me that it's completely dynamic. Uh, Process so it's not static. Also, we, we can see here that uh, there are two checkboxes in the left top corner of my screen. First one is for reflection probes, it's a default Unity 5 reflection method. It's very cheap, it's super, super duper cheap. So, it's uh, nice for planar reflections and for very basic reflections. But what uh, screen space a reflection does add to the scene, you will see very soon. So let's just turn off screen space reflection and turn on only reflection probe. And you can see that uh, we have just a very plain and very not realistic reflection. So if you look over here, you can see that uh, it's super not realistic. Of course, you can dig around and find some uh, shaders, but those shaders will be really heavy on GPU and uh, CPU, so it's not really necessary to dig around. You have this wonderful project, which provides you with screen space reflections. Of course, in Unity 5.3, Unity is planning to add full support for their own fully working uh, SSRR. Uh, so, R stands for ra race. I mean, not racing, I mean, or a cast or something like this. So, please stay tuned for December. So the the 8 of December 2015, and you, you and there will be Unity 5.3 with full support of uh, screen space reflections with rays, with ray cast or whatever rays. And uh, also, I will show you some uh, defects, some bugs in this. Uh, wonderful add-on project because uh, it's very cool it's very nice free addition for your game but it also has some glitches and bugs first of all let's go uh, away from this uh, game mode and you can see that it's working correctly and you can see it only in a game window you cannot see how it does work in editor it's number one problem. The problem number two is that it's um, you cannot be sure how it will be looking in your game. Let's just create a simple sphere 
uh, somewhere in the center of this one bit linze. Im object, 3D object sphere. Let's make it bigger. This three, 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 and move it somewhere aside. Now let's go back to our uh, game mode, and you will see that it affects. So you, you can see that. Uh, okay, so this a reflection is okay, but if you just put it, you know, somehow, you know, deep into floor, you will see some problems. So, for instance, just have a look over here. So, uh, you should not have a reflection of the sphere over here. It should be, uh, you know, uh, covered by the sphere by the sphere itself. This edge should be over here, behind the sphere, not over here. Also, there is another defect, you know, the bug glitch over here. So it's not it's not absolutely correct and accurate. Keep this in mind. But still, it's free for everyone to use. There are many many paid assets on Asset Store, and they are pretty expensive. And this uh, project from Code 80 is free for everyone to download and use for free. So just keep this in mind. But once again, it has some glitches and bugs. So also <laughs> keep this in mind too. Also, there are many uh, settings over here, and you should play around with those settings. And they are all connected to main camera, so only here, only here, SSR, simple script. You can see here, blur quality, which stands for the, Q, for the quality of blur, so how, you know, less visible your objects will be in the game. Let us play with this quality. You can see it here. Also, it's very interesting uh, stuff here. It's about iterations. So uh, please keep in mind that it should be, you know, uh, normal amount. So it should be like in, a, you know, uh, 10, 20, but not like this, uh, because this will, this, you know, such numbers will kill your CPU and it will make this. Uh, effect not suitable for your uh, mobile devices if you are targeting uh, App Store or Google Play. So just keep this, you know, with this. Uh, I tested it with mobile and uh, I have Sony Xperia SD25i and I should say that uh, if I uh, use not default settings, I increase such settings. Uh, my phone has some lugs, but if I use default settings from the project, it, you know, it's okay. Also, there are many stuff like, you know, the face depth. Okay, you will not see it here, but you will see it here. Let's just uh, go closer to some object, you know, like this. Okay, you cannot see this. It's really really minor minor effect while this one is not minor effect so you can see that it's uh for for down sample you know it's it's very hard to explain this but it's about uh you know choppiness of your scene i mean of your uh reflection so by default you should not touch this this and this slider you should touch only this one and maybe uh you know, such sliders, but not, not this, not this, not this. So, these sliders, these sliders maybe, and maybe this one. So, and actually that's all I wanted to show you in this video, guys. I hope you like this uh, example project. Once again, it's free for everyone to download and, you know, to use. It's made by code, you know, code80.com. Uh, team and uh, yeah thanks 
thanks for watching this video have a good time and bye 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 and have a good time see you later in the next video about something very interesting or maybe not very interesting feel free to test the load and use this project bye bye stop recording immediately in five four three two one